hope and notice that your characters on Salem, they both are sort of like two sides of the same coin. They both were innocents that started out uh, manipulated by the system. Your character turns out to be kind of crazy and, and power mad and e maybe evil. Yeah. And you were sort of uh, treated a bit like a schmuck a little bit. Like, you're, you're not treated really well. So are we going to see an evolution of those characters? Are you actually going to be able to interact a little bit in this season? Um, without saying too much, yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Um, but um, we won't obviously say when, how, and where. Uh, but we do our cross, uh, our paths do cross, and um, it's pretty, it's pretty good, pretty fun stuff. We've got uh, a lot of fun stuff to do in this very, in this very in room. In this very room, actually, which mm. is Mercy's room. Yeah. yeah. Um, um, got a bit crazy. Oh yeah, yeah. That's it's a it's a huge evolution for both of us. I think from I had had didn't anticipate any of that of her evolution of becoming you know from an innocent imprisoned. Um, young girl who just wants to be normal and then now she's castrating men, you know, so <laughs> I just feel like I was not I mean, who does expect that? I don't, you would be weird if you did, but <laughs> I'm, yeah, it's always a surprise and it's always just so fun especially with such geniuses like Brandon and Adam mm -hmm. behind it. So castrating men was not listed in your character bio. Actually, uh, it was, yeah. but um, I didn't think they would use it. So yeah. they wouldn't use it to my advantage, but they did. So yeah. Does Mercy uh, see Isaac as take pity on him and perhaps is uh, someone that she might want to bring into, you know, use him and bring him into the fold a little bit? There's some version of that. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't say you're quite on the right track. <laughs> Um, but it, it does, it, it's going to make for a fun viewing. It's going to be... Uh, fun? Yeah, I think, I think people are going to definitely get a kick out of it. Well, both of your, your performances are so physical. Um, mm -hmm. And you know, talk a little bit about that, about how you want Isaac to be physical and how you bring about that kind of uh, Isaac personality versus you know the mercy crazed mm -hmm. thing. I don't know if that's it. If that's the that official, is a great is that way of describing mm -hmm. the mercy crazed thing. It's like part of my interpretive dance oh, yeah. of I Salem. Love it. But I love it. talk about the physicality a little bit. I, I yeah Isaac from from the get go of season one. Uh, you know he's shamed in front of the, uh, the whole of Salem, and I, I think with his physicality, I you know what I was thinking about is just how. He carries that shame with him every day and it is it's it's literally like a a, a scar on his forehead and Reminded. just the idea of, of hiding that and walking around with these things are hidden and I think he kind of represents the average Joe you know that we we have all these issues within ourselves and we think that we're the only people that have these issues mm -hmm. and we try and hide them we're not necessarily honest about them so I think there's a lot of him uh, a lot about him that is that and the idea of you know of that coming out in your physical movement is you know, just being closed off and not not allowing people to see too much. I mean, yeah. I, I I think that I think for both of us, when you when you have such a physical role, it really does help you just get it get into that place even even more. I mean, it, it, it's just a great tool, I guess, mm -hmm. to to help you f to facilitate you in a way in order to get to that place. Um, that's what I find. I mean. From the market scene to um, any scene where she has to be really physical, it's just like it gets you. I don't know. I mean, it's dance and art, it, like it has that movement. And just if you are aware of your body and if you're aware of like such your limbs, I mean, you have so much more control over what you can. Yeah, I could go on and on about that. <laughs> yeah. So not just this. It's not just this, just but that. it's like this. Oh wow. Well, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Lots of weight. Okay. I yeah. like it. All right. Well, thanks so much for your time, guys. <laughs> I look forward to seeing you so much. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks.